all for class 7 subject mathematics so today we are going to start the next topic of perimeter and area in the last classes we learnt about how to find the area of a rectangle and a square right the perimeter and area of a rectangle and a square now here in this topic we are going to learn the area of the circle or the circumference what is the meaning of circumference means this line the that is the la, the curved line of a circle completing the circle is known as a circumference what it is known as circumference that is the outline of a circle is known as a circumference now what is the diameter a diameter is a line which exactly divides the circle into two half that we have already learned okay diameter is a line which cuts the circle into two equal half that is known as the diameter then what is the radius the radius is the from the center towards the circumference any line drawn from the center to the circumference is known as the radius is the radius single there no how many radi radii can we draw we can draw infinite radii in a circle clear so now what is the relation between the diameter and the radius you can see here this red line is one di one radius and again here the blue line makes one more radius two radius will make one diameter okay Two radius will make a diameter. Diameter is equal to 2 into radius. Then what is the circumference of a circle? Then the circumference of a circle is 2 pi r. What it is? 2 pi r. Here pi is a constant because it is in a circle. So we take the pi value. Pi is equal to circumference by diameter. What is pi? Pi is circumference divided by diameter. Now circumference for that we take pi by d. Then diameter is again d. So d and d the diameter will get cancelled and pi. Okay. Pi value the constant value of the pi is 3.14 or 22 by 7. This is the constant value which we are going to use for the pi. Clear? Now the formula for the circumference is the circumference of a circle is equal to 2 pi r. Why do we use this? To find the area of the circle. How much space is there in between the circle? For that what formula we use? 2 pi r. r is nothing but the radius. Or we can write pi d. Why? Because 2 r is nothing but the d. That is diameter is equal to 2 r. Therefore, you can even write pi d. If it is given, for example, example it is given that radius is 14, find the circumference. That will be the question. So, circumference is equal to 2 pi r. That will become 2 into 22 by 7 into 14. Okay. 7 ones are 7 twos are 14. Once you multiply this 2 into 22, 44 into 2, that will make it 88 centimeter. Okay. Then, the same way again, area of the circle is equal to pi r square. Circumference means overall length, perimeter we did know. Circumference means how we had the perimeter. That is, perimeter is different and area is different. Perimeter includes the boundary of the figure. Area is only inside the figure. That you should understand. Okay. Even here it is circumference is nothing but the that, that is perimeter then area of the circle. Now circumference of circle means perimeter of a circle 2 pi r then area of the circle is pi r square. r square means r into r. If they have given the radius 7 centimeter find the area of the circle means you will use the formula pi r square. That is nothing but what is pi value? 22 by 7 into 7 into 7. 7 and 7 get cancelled. 22 into 7 makes it 154 centimeter square. Now here we will start the exercise that is exercise 11.3. The first question here find the circumference of a circle with the following radius. Here the radius is given, you have to find what circumference. 
What is the formula of circumference? That is nothing but 2 pi r. Correct? 2 pi r is the formula for the circumference. What is radius given? The first radius is 14 cm. Therefore, just substitute r as 14 there. 2 into 22 by 7 into 14. So, 7 1 times 7, 7 2 is 14. 2 into 22 into 2 that will make that it make it 88 centimeter. Similarly, you have to do the next B and C. The second question here, find the area of the following circle given that radius is equal to 14 millimeters. Take pi is equal to 22 by 7. Same even here, what is the formula of area? Area is pi r square that you should remember. Once you remember the formula, then you can solve it very easily. Okay. Now, a radius is given 14 millimeter. Then area is equal to pi r square is nothing but r into r. So, write this radius two times. 22 by 7 into 14 into 14. 7 1 times 7. 7 2 times 14. So, here what happens? 22 into 2 is 44. 44 into 14 will make it 616 millimeter square. Same way here, the C you can do the exactly same. The B1 they have given diameter. So, once the diameter is given, how to find the radius? Radius is equal, uh, diameter is equal to 2R, right? So, radius, will, radius is equal to D by 2. So, diameter is given 49. Radius will make it 49 by 2. Okay, half of the diameter will make it radius. Now, what is the area? Area is equal to pi r square. That is r into r. Pi is 22 by 7 into 49 by 2 into 49 by 2. Once you solve this, you can you will get the answer. You can do the rest here. You 2 ones are 2 11 times here. 7 ones are 7 7 is 49. Afterwards, you just multiply, you will get the answer. Third one is the same. You have to find the area of the sheet there. Now, we will do the fourth one. A gardener wants to fence a circular garden. What, how is the circle? That is, the garden is in the form of a circle. They have to fence the garden. Means, they have to give, means put the wiring around the garden there. It will be in which shape? It will be in the circle form. So, what is given? The diameter is given 21 meter. Find the length of the rope he need to purchase if he makes two rounds of fence. Also, find the cost of rope if the cost rupees 4 per meter. So, first what we have to find? We have to find the circumference here. So, what is fencing? Fencing is nothing but the completing of the round. He is taking two times. Okay. The rope. Rope is being circled here. All How they will fence means they will just cover the circle so that no one should enter the circle. That is what it is fencing means. Now, he is taking two times. Double the rope. So, here what it is that is that is nothing but the one round will make one circumference. Correct. So, that will take uh, that is nothing but pi d. Why I am taking d? Because d is already taken. Instead of that, you can take 2 pi r also. Okay. We can use both the formula there. Since it is given diameter, it is easy to take pi d. Right. Instead of changing to radius and taking here, take the direct formula that is pi d. That is nothing but 22 by 7 into what is the diameter? 21 into 10, 21. 7 1 times 7, 7 3 times 21. So, 22 into 3 will make it 66 meters. Now, the circumference of this ground is how much? 66 meters. But he wants to take it into 2 round length. Okay. 2 times he wants to fence it. So, it will become what? How much it is? 2 into 66. That is equal to 122 meters. Okay. So, that will make it 132 meters. So, 132 meters rope he has taken. Now, the cost of 1, ro one meter rope is how much given? 4 rupees. Rupees 4 for 1 meter. So, so, for 132 meter how much? Just multiply. That is 132 into 4. You will get the answer there. So, now here the fifth question. 
from a circular sheet of radius 4 cm a circle of radius 3 cm is removed find the area of the remaining sheet now you can see here this is this will be our figure that is a circular sheet of how many cm 4 cm in that they have cut 3 cm sheet inside so how much area is remaining this blue color area how much is there that we have to say here so how we will take means the remaining sheet that is from bigger circle minus smaller circle you can see two circles right so bigger will be 4 cm inner will be 3 cm so remain minus bigger minus smaller will give us this play this area right remaining area of this so directly i'll take the formula there that is remaining side remaining shape uh, remaining sheet area is equals to bigger circle area minus smaller circle area area formula is what that is pi r square correct so pi r and r for the bigger you take capital r for smaller you take small r so that it will not be confusing r and r so capital r value is 4 and the small r value is 3 so what they have taken what they have given take the value of pi as 3.14 what will be given in the question that you can take if it is not given here you can take as per your wish that is 22 by 7 or 3.14 ok so here it is given 3.14 so same we have to use here 3.14 into 4 into 4 minus 3.14 into 3 into 3 so now you can see here the answer once you multiply this you will get 50.24 minus 28.26 you do the subtraction like this ok what happens here once after doing the subtraction the answer is 21.98 cm square whenever you are writing area or perimeter the unit is compulsory in the answer ok 